All right, what's going on? I'm gonna be showing you guys how to install NVE uh, for 5M by Raise. Uh, it's not free. You're gonna have to purchase it on Raised Patreon. I'll put a link in the description. Um, so once you're here, you're gonna wanna go to this page, click download here, and there'll be a whole bunch of links, and click the 5M NVE package to download. Once you have that downloaded, it should look like this. And make sure you have a WinRAR or 7-zip so you can extract this and click Extract to NVE. I already have it extracted and it will pop up with a open file for you. And we're going to click the README. And then we're going to have this open and this open, and we're going to scroll down to the README. The first two steps we're going to skip, and we're going to go into finding our 5M um, application data. So to do that, what we're going to do is we're going to do run. And then we're going to enter this right here. I'll put it in the description. And click OK. And then this is where your 5M application data is. So you're going to double click on that. And this is where you're going to be installing everything. So once you're here, you're going to go to the main package. I already have it installed, but here, I'll go to this one, the main package right here. And you're going to copy these into the 5M application data like this. Boom. And wait for those. I already have them in there, so it's going to say, do you want to play? So I'm going to say no. So once those are done, um, we're going to move on to the optional add-ons. So these are optional. You don't need to install them. But the ones I have are um, Mission Row Police Department. So all you do is just drag drop and then maybe I didn't have it um, I have weapons hall overlay just drag and drop um, parallax roads is good animated gas and uh, street lights for street lights you want to do white street lights and you'll drag this file into here like this I already have it and then for the shader input we could exit out of this because we're done installing our optionals we're going to open up our GTA 5 main directory so to get to that we're going to go to Steam right click on GTA 5 go to browse local files and we are going to install the shader input and just drag and drop it's already in there, right there, so I'm not going to install it. But it should say, do you want to replace? And click yes, because that's normal. Because the you should already have a shader input file there. Or if you don't, just drag it in there. So after you install all your optional add-ons, uh, go to EMB required. And you could use any one of, any three of these. But for this one, we're going to go with um, the medium which is the recommended all you do is drag these files and drop into here main directory I already have them and boom we are done installing NVE so all we need to do now is launch our game and fix some settings inside of our game So you know you'll have it installed when you see um, all the EMB series stuff in the top left. That means you have it installed right.
And what I like to do for 5M is I like to hit escape settings, advanced graphics, and I like to go full screen exclusive. So I can change my frames. Yes. Alright, let's go to the graphics. So, you must have Direct Direct X 11. So make sure you change this to Direct Direct X 11 if you have it on a different version. And then you must have your post effects. Let me just get in here. Your post effects on very high or ultra, and your particle quality on very high or ultra. So post effects is on ultra, and my Particle quality is on very high. You could have this on uh, very high, um, but it doesn't really change much. You can see in the video memory, it's not changing much, so I keep mine on ultra. And then um, you need to have your shader quality on very high for the EMB shaders to work. Oh. <sighs> Also, right here, in the extended texture budget, make sure this is all the way up. And in the advanced graphics, we're going to go to extended distance scaling. You need this to be up so um, stuff doesn't disappear in your 5M. And after that, what you could do to get into the menu is click Shift Enter. And you could enable your FPS limit. Um, you could go to input and have a key to show your FPS. So I set my key to zero. So whenever I click zero, it shows my FPS in the top left. And yeah, that's how you install NVE for 5M GTA. Peace.